Welcome to Lavanya's Computer Classes. In this video, I will explain most important questions in PPS, Programming for Problem Solving. These are the very, very important questions in PPS. So, uh, actually it is a corona pattern. So, you learn any three and half units. If you learn three and half units, it is very easy to attempt all the questions because you have to write only five questions out of eight questions. So, I will explain some very, very important questions in PPS. So, what is the first question means? What is data type? Explain the different types of data types. Data types, its ranges and uh, syntaxes, everything explain. So, first definition, what is data type? And what are the different types of data types in C language? Next, very, very important question is, what is an operator? explain the different types of operators in C language. So here in this they are asking all the questions in, uh, in single question or they are asking in different different formats. Explain bitwise operators, explain relational operators, anything. Next one is what is typecasting? Typecasting or type conversion. So whatever the answer question but answer is same. Explain about typecasting or explain about type conversion. Next one is storage classes. Explain the different types of storage classes are available in C language. Next, this is a your fundamental question. What is algorithm and what is a flowchart? What are the symbols are used in flowchart? Explain everything with to uh, take any example, simple example. Draw, uh, write algorithm for the simple example and also draw flowchart for the simple example. Next, conditional statements. In the conditional statements, we have to write learn nested if and also switch switch statements next question is looping statements in the looping statements for loop while loop do while but mostly programs are coming from for loop and do while that is also um, mostly factor of a given number gcd fibonacci series next what is an array different types of arrays single dimensional array double dimensional array with example programs example programs means so matrix multiplication transpose of a matrix and find minimum and maximum element in the given array that is also very very important next use user defined functions use a defined functions you go for call by value call by reference call by reference and important is recursion Recursion is very, very important. Next, structures. What is a structure? How to declare structure? Any structure example program. Once we learn structure, automatically union is also coming. Same concept of structure and union. Our difference between structure and union is very important question. Next to files. What is file? Different types of files. What are the file operations? File modes. Very, very important question. In the file modes, and also two programs are very important in this. One is the copy, copy the content of one file into another file. Second one is merging. These two programs are very important in file concept programs. Next one is pointers, pointers and its operations. Next important question is uh, dynamic memory allocation. It is also a theory question but very very important. Next one is searching and sorting. In the searching, you have to learn linear search and binary search with numerical examples. And in the sorting, there are three sorting techniques are there. Insertion sort, bubble sort, and uh, insertion, selection, and bubble sort. These three sortings you learn with numerical examples and programs also. And last question is string handling functions. What is a string? What are the string handling functions? Everything we learn with one program. Explain with program, then we get it is very easily. So, uh, these are the very, very important questions. You have to learn dynamic memory allocation. These are the theory questions. Uh, next one is storage classes. Typecasting. Typecasting the type conversion. Enum. Enum is also important question and preprocessor commands. In these five questions, one question is compulsory coming in the examination. Dynamic memory allocation that is also important question. So learn all these important questions and write PPS exam is well. Thank you for watching my video. 
If you like this video, please subscribe, subscribe my channel and share it. Thank you.